of hope, you can still go I never ran, said a no, man, I still go Go, 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 go Hello my darlings, so today we're going on a very special field trip We are headed to my neighborhood CBS, and this is not sponsored But I wanted to share with you um, this particular CBS I feel like I've done it before, but maybe not because this is actually like I, I don't what they call it like a beauty bar cbs or beauty something cbs but it's really built like a sephora it's very reminiscent of a sephora so i just want to show you just in case you have a cbs that's like this in your area and you've been wondering about it um but yeah i just thought it was you know i'm going in here anyway so i'm like let me take you guys with me so let's go all right my darling so here we are and i have this annoying cart that's making noise and so excuse me <laughs> if it's annoying you i'll try to not make it so loud all right so it looks like we're wiped out of concealers i really want to try another lip oil let's see let's see they need to restock. I wanted uh, different color eyeliners. Here they're five fifty nine. Okay. So maybe not the eyeliners. Let's look at lips. Oh gosh, they wipe out of lips too. <laughs> All right, let's head over to Maybelline because I want to try some of their eye products. But let me show you. This is the Revlon section. I'm not a Revlon girl either. <laughs> CVS Beauty. And that's the thing about this particular one is that they have beauty brands that they don't have in other areas. So, oh, they have Mented. I've been wanting to try their, um, the Mented, um, what you call it? Mented, um, eyeshadow palette. They have the lip glosses. Oh, that's so cool. Let's see, Prideful. Okay, I've never heard of that brand. Brilliant. They have Elme. L'Oreal, which I love L'Oreal because they're all, well, L'Oreal is owned, or owns MAC, by the way, Estee Lauder Company. All right, let's go to Maybelline. Maybelline, let's see what's going on here. They do have the Instant Age Rewind, and they have it in a deeper skin tone. I need a little bit darker than that. Let's go to the eye stuff. Oh no, the lip stuff I wanted to try too. Um, if you've been a part of my lives, then you know that I am loving the lip filler. Let's see. So they have the liquid vinyl. Do they have the lip stuff here? It doesn't look like it. Era. Okay, so I guess they don't have <laughs> they don't have anything that came in here before. <sighs> okay, this is a flop. This is a flop. I just have one. Okay. I was gonna get the matte bar. Oh, sorry. I was gonna get the matte bar. It's $13.99 here. I guess I'll be ordering off of Amazon because they don't have anything that I wanted to show you guys. Okay. So this is what I want to talk about. Hey guys. So they do like ear piercing here. They have like a blow dry bar. It's like a whole situation. Oh, hold on, what's this? Sorry, okay, like it's a whole situation. But they don't have anything that I want, so. <laughs> Let's see, they have Nailtopia. Oh, they have Flower. Oh, they have Yuma Beauty. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Do we want any of these things here? Flower Beauty, which is by Drew Barrymore. I feel like she has some lip products that I want to try, but I don't remember what they are. Lip stain, petal pout. I think it was the petal pout. Lip trim up with a piece of color. I need to do some research. That's the only thing about when you're buying from a um, from a CVS or something like that. You you know you can't test it. What's this? Purple mascara. They do have Yoma Beauty. 
What is this? Buy stuff for beautiful brows. Yeah, but what's the brand? What's the brand name? I'm not messing around. <laughs> I'm not messing around with that. Anastasia is who I wear. Oh, they have Roma Beauty. Um, Luna Magic. Oh, one by two black one. Hmm. Have you guys heard of this brand? I've never heard of this brand. Oh, I love this little brush set. Sorry. Beautiful color. Hmm. They have Essence. Yeah, I'm not messing with any of their brow stuff. Okay, well, I guess they don't have... I would try... Oops, sorry. I would try this, but I already have these colors. And I really want, like, a matte palette. This is pretty. It's very pretty. I get so tempted with these brow, these brow things, but they never work. But then this is a whole brow situation. I don't... What is the brand name? All right. Well, that's a bust for me. Amazon, here we come. All right, my darling. So it's two weeks later. <laughs> and I actually did find the palette that I was looking for at another CVS. These are actually cheaper on Amazon, but I had the Amazon dollar perks, whatever, whatever we'll call it, coupons. And so I just used it on this. Um, and I also got... Um, one of the lip glosses. This is in 008. I've been such a fan of these lifter lifter glosses. And so we're going to put that on. And then also, I was intrigued by the brow, um, what is this? Angled Brow Shaded Pencil by Arches and Halos by Tanya Brooks. This is a dupe for my beloved Anastasia Brow Definer. And so I feel like I'm cheating on my brow definer, but I just wanted to see if there was anything else out there. I am tried and true to Anastasia. So we're gonna see how that works. So let's get into it. I am using my concealer. I did not see any, this is um by Milk Makeup. I did not see, nor was I trying to see um, any um, face products as far as foundations or anything like that. Maybelline um, and L'Oreal. Maybelline is great as far as like pigment. Um, if you are a woman of color, I feel like they have a great shade range, but L'Oreal as well. They're all owned. L'Oreal is owned by um, Estee Lauder. And so you're always going to get a great product there. So let's get into these shadows. So what I appreciate about the shadow is that or that this palette is that it has some transition colors. It has base, well, what I can see is a base color and a crease color. So we're gonna go ahead and we are going to, oh Lord, I'm scared of the kickback. Let's see how this looks. I'm gonna mix these two together. How these people, <laughs> these, um, these beauty influencers, let's get the hair behind the ears. Let's see. have my mirror here. Oh, so mixing them again. And I chose the matte one because for me, it's, I think it's difficult to do a good matte palette. Okay, 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 okay. Okay. And let's do transition shade here. I should have done my brows first. Eh, we'll do it afterwards. There's no rhyme, and reason, rhyme or reason for how you go about doing your eyes. So you can, however you feel like doing them is how you feel like doing them, okay? All right, so there's that, which, and I'm actually growing out my brows. So. This is where it gets tricky, tricky, tricky. Hold on. All right. So what I want to do is I want to go into this one here. And this has been like dyed by my dark powder. So don't, don't pay attention to that. So I'm going to go into this one here. Mm -hmm. Maverick is snoring, by the way. So <laughs> can you hear him? Like some good sleep, y'all. Good sleep. I'm going to go back in here. 
what I'm looking for, and I actually need to put my fingers in it because I want to see how creamy it is, but I really want to see the pigment first. I want to see how it lays down. It's a little peachy pinky on me, which I don't mind. Okay. I usually use my fingers, but I want to see how it does with the brush. There's not a lot of fallout. Okay. All right. And then I want to go in the crease with the dark brown color, this color here. I'm gonna go in the crease with that color. Mm. Don't need a lot. to go out like that okay all right let's do the other eye I know this is a little tedious guys but I'm doing this for those of you who are literally watching step by step let's go in the corner get that together and then work your way out and then kind of step back to see if it's all doing what it needs to do All right, so what I am gonna do, I am gonna stick my finger in this. Okay, and I like to go along the lower lash line with my finger. You can do it with a brush, I just do it with my finger. And I usually do it with the excess, but because I didn't use my hands this time. Ooh, do I have any excess? Let's see, did I bring a liner? Did I put a liner? Yeah, we'll do a purple liner. Or should we keep it brown? Maverick is really out here sleeping. Let me get a liner. Be right back. Okay, so this is a Morphe liner. This is in like an army green. I'm sure that they have liners. I just didn't pick one up. I was so gung ho about the um, about the um, eyeshadow. I didn't think about the liner. All right. All right. So we're gonna keep it neutral. Let's do these eyebrows. <laughs> I should have done that first but it is what a TI is. So it comes with a little brush. Let's let's see how it looks against, where did I put the honest So let's see, oh, sorry guys. Let's see what it looks like against Can you see that? Let me see, let me give you guys more light. Oh, sorry. So this is the Anastasia brush. And this is, let me do it right. Yeah, there we go. This is the Tanya's brush. All right. Smaller, shorter. As I told you, I'm growing out my brows. Just to, I like the brush, okay. Okay, so this is how much, oh, so you get a little bit more here, but I don't know if it starts like right there, right? I don't know where it starts. Hmm, okay, oh, no, wrong one. Let's put this back so that I don't, okay, <laughs> so that I don't get lost. And I'm gonna put, in my, put on my mascara. So this one is a little thicker, which I don't mind. Let's see. 
You know, I'm playing with my brows, guys. All right, let's see. Okay, good color match. Okay. Feels good. Into in the mirror. Okay. Feels very soft. I'm not mad at it. Feels very soft. And then you just brush the, so it's not as harsh. Okay, let's do this one. I have less brow here, so I really have to create a brow on this side. It's really good. I'm I like I like what I'm feeling. Very easy. I love the color. Yeah, guys, so far the real test will be does it last under this Florida humidity? The thing about the other brow pencils is that they're so soft that they just melt but this one feels it's soft like it's smooth as far as it going on but i think that it will maverick is really out here snoring i think that <laughs> hear that hmm i'm impressed I'm impressed. So what I want to do, now that the brows are on, I want to go a bit deeper in this dark color here. I want to give it more depth. I actually think I'm going to mix. Mmm. What I did is I mixed this one with this one. All right, so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna clean up with concealer, put on a bit of mascara, and then we'll be back with foundation, blush, and lips. All right, so I was gonna do this trick off camera. I was like, why would I do that off camera? They're tuning into a tutorial for a reason. All right, so I take you see here where I've like come down a little bit too far outside of my, I don't know if you want to call it an eye line, whatever you want to call it. What I do to fix that, I literally just kind of draw a line right there. Kind of just fix it that way. Because sometimes, don't mess up the under eye or anything like that. You don't even really touch it. You just from here to here where you've just done a little, you've gone a little bit outside of the line, you just put some concealer there. And I'll do the same over here. Just clean it up. There are many different ways to do it, but that's what I do, okay? All right. All right, that was, that was it. All right, so let me put on some foundation. What are we putting on today? We are gonna put on, oh, I'm so sorry. We're gonna put on my favorite right now because I haven't bought back the Armani. I need to do that. Um, the Ultra Latent, this Chanel, it was like $55. It's worth every penny out. It is worth every bit of $55. This thing stays on like, I don't know what. And the color is amazing. And I go right into my hairline. Oh, it's so good. And I just do one little pump, that much. 
not a lot. We're getting into those warmer months where I start to do my humidity makeup routine, but not yet. But I'm starting to actually wear less and less makeup. So like one pump is all I need. All right. Quick blush, my tried and true. I'm a creature of habit, guys. I really am. I was going to get the House Labs. Um... Tom Ford, the House Labs pink, which I probably will still do. Um, but in this season of saving, I'm like, you know what? That's $70. <laughs> I can use that in England to buy some kind of thrifted fabulousness. So I'll do without. I'll do I'll do with what I have right now. Some things, yes, but I don't need any more blush. Pers well, who, let me not lie. I'll probably get some before I leave. <laughs> All right, so we are going to go into this lifter. Let me make sure I didn't forget anything. We did the brow. We did the eye. This is the matte. Love a good matte eye. Um, lifter Gloss by Maybelline, and this is color Stone. I'm trying to see if I'll even need. Let's try it. Do I have my makeup wipes? Okay, so I have my trusty makeup wipes. Let's do it without, the without liner and with liner so that we can see so good and this one has so this is the thing it has hyaluronic acid which adds moisture to your face like if you have a, a moisturizer with hyaluronic acid it's moisturized for your face uh retains water for your face so the reason why it's called lifter gloss is because it's actually putting moisture back in your lips with age we just lose volume in our lips it just is what it is black white asian hispanic whatever ethnicity you are it just is what it is so this is promising to fill your lips back back up not necessarily be a plumper but fill them back up so let's see oh oh this is without a gloss i mean without a liner Do we need a liner? I don't think we need a liner. This is giving me bronzed goddess. With a matte eye. I don't think we need a liner. Let's see with a liner. While we're here. While we're here, let's do it over with a liner. So this is without a liner. Feels good. Okay. Okay. All right. Not stopping the video. <laughs> I'm not stopping the video. <laughs> it's what I typically do. Let's go back over the lips. This is a Sephora liner, one of my favorites. You've seen it over and over again in Rosewood. Ah, oh, that's so pretty. This is gonna change the color of it. I definitely know that. And I don't know if I wanna change the color. I really liked what it was giving. It's pretty, it's just, that's not what I want right now. Let's go back. Let's just wipe it off again. I do this all the time. <laughs> that's why I have 500 packs of these Target wipes. Okay. Okay. So the crowd has the crowd has spoken. We like stone without a liner. Ah. 
Oh yes. So I'm gonna leave a link to this one and then a few more because I did get a few more, but I just want to show you the palette number one, but let's do this. Let's meet up next week. If I can open this, because I did get more colors. I did get more of these colors. This is just the one that I felt went with this palette. So we'll meet again next week and we'll do some of this in here. Because I did see a tutorial with this pink and I love it. it was these three colors. This one, this one, and this one. And I want to recreate it. So we'll have fun. I'll recreate it with you guys. And I have a pinkier lip. I'm so excited. But yes, this feels really good, guys. Hmm. All right, enough looking at myself. Please give me a thumbs up. Let me know if you like this type of content, if you want more of my type of makeup makeup tutorials. There are loads of makeup tutorials up there. And to be fair, I was like, why would they, they there's so many makeup tutorials, why would they wanna learn from me? But this is my perspective on makeup and how I do makeup. And so I'm gonna continue to give you guys makeup. And so if you like this type of content, please give me a thumbs up. Um, subscribe if you're not subscribed already. What's going on? Don't you want more shoulder action? <laughs> love you guys so much see you soon and again we're gonna do we're gonna use this palette again next week so go ahead click on the link in the description box because it's cheaper at amazon and order your palette so we can um we can play together next week all right love you guys so much oh and the uh, chat the this too which i'm loving all right that's enough bye hi guys so i'm about to go live i'm in my bathroom but i wanted to show you i've had on the I'm sorry, I know the video was supposed to have ended, but I have um, my train of thought. I'm about to go live. I've had the eye makeup on for now about two or three hours. There's no creasing. It's still very much matte and I look amazing if I should say so myself. My lip gloss is worn off, but this is really good. And I think the palette's like 10 bucks. So I'm gonna leave a link to it below again, but I just want to hop on. I know the video had ended, but again, sorry, I'm like looking over here, I'm looking at myself. Um, I just want to show you, this is the real deal, Maybelline. Okay, I'm impressed. Let me know if you want me to do another Maybelline palette because there were two more that I wanted to try, but um, I'm a believer. All right, let me go, love you. Bye for real. <laughs> I never ran, sitting on man, I still go, go, go.